Hi, my name is Jan Vandeven, and I'm the European candidate for the South constituency for Direct Democracy Ireland. You know, a lot of people ask me about direct democracy, and sometimes they ask about the history. It was actually invented in, in, in Switzerland. Direct democracy, or citizen-initiated referendum, was invented in Switzerland. It started off with a bunch of citizens working with the legislators. They said, basically, go ahead and, and lead, go ahead and legislate, but we want to approve everything. So once a year, they all got together in the town square, the, the, the legislators, uh, the parliamentarians, read off the laws, and the people voted them up or down. Then they decided to initiate um, law by, um, by gathering signatures. That was different. Instead of voting laws up, and, up, up or down uh, uh, and created by the parliamentarians, they said, look, if we can gather a bunch of signatures uh, of a critical threshold, let's say 2% of the voters, uh, around an issue, then we should have a referendum on that because it's important enough. And if it gets voted up, it becomes law. So, so through that, they discovered that you could initiate law, create law, throw out law, or change law, and even recall a politician with referendum if you were unhappy. So this, this idea or concept uh, appealed to the framers of the first Irish Free State Constitution. Unfortunately, as, as, um, as, um, as, as politics uh, always is and how it went on, the first Doyle actually took it out of the, out of the, uh, out of the Constitution and everybody protested. Eventually, they delayed having a referendum on the Constitution until 1937, and direct democracy was never put back in. Now, we at Direct Democracy Ireland have identified that as the Achilles heel of our own democracy and, and the reason it's failing or it's become dysfunctional. And so we want to put direct democracy back into the Constitution. We want to empower the people to be able to push back on laws and, and you know, recently all the things that have happened with the bank bailouts and the property charges, things that are really unpopular, we want to be able to push back on that. So we're trying to get that same power back into the Constitution. So if, you, if that appeals to you, I would, I would urge you to vote for me, to give me your number one vote, and we can start that process rolling to get back that power into the Irish Constitution. So vote for me. Thank you very much.